Hello, good people of the interwebs. It is Haley, and I am back with another video. And this is part three in our charm and charm bracelet extravaganza. So I was on the hunt for a bracelet for my neighbor. So sweet. He has chickens and he has given us some eggs. And anyway, I wanted I wanted to bring him a little something. And I knew I had these. I had been, these are the original bracelets that I had set aside probably six, seven months ago when I had started planning this video. I had pulled out the ones I had. And since then I've been, you know, setting aside the charms that I come across, but the original ones I could not find. Found them. So we have six more bracelets. Really these were the five. And then I went ahead and pulled this out too. And we are going to finish up as many of our charms as possible. I also found um, a small bag of charms, including initials and names. So super exciting. If you are interested in purchasing anything from this video, please email me at Haley's Jewelry and More at gmail.com. I will pin the sold list at, in the top of the description box and in the pinned comment. Um, let's see. You can pause to read and get the info. And yes, the sale is still going on. And if you bought items, bracelets, or charms from the first part one or two, that discount continues. If you had, you know, bought two charms before, then, and you buy one here, that's your third charm. And the deal is, if you buy a bracelet, then your first charm is a dollar off, second, two dollars off, third, three dollars off, fourth, four dollars off, and every charm after that is four dollars off with a maximum of twenty-five dollars per person, per bundle. So, um, you can continue that if you bought a couple from the first video. So yeah, if, and you find another one or two. So let us get started. I'm going to go ahead and do the bracelets first. This will be number 86. So this one I actually just retested. Um, it's so, I mean, it just looks, it's very heavy, it's nice, shiny. It's like this I always question everything and that's why you'll often see there's a like more than one scratch mark on it and it's just redundancy but it was immediately whole whole scratch glowed blue it is for sure sterling um, this is six and a half inches on the bracelet mandrel it is marked 925 and I want to show you the end just retested it actually. Let me use this one. There you go. So, any hoozle. It is a six and a half inch sterling silver um, charm bracelet with a heart in the center. Toggle clasp, very heavy. Also, um, I will be giving away a couple items in this video. I have a pewter ring. I love this ring, it's so funny. And then this is costume. This is a costume bell charm or pendant, whatever you want. Um, and there will be a secret word. From the last video, someone did claim the uh, item with the secret word. However, um, they emailed me to purchase an item but they gave me the wrong number. Like they described the item and then gave me a number and they didn't match and I emailed and was like, hey, did you mean this? And I never got an email back. So if that's you, if you emailed, uh, please let me know. And if not, I mean, if anyone else is sees anything in part two they wanna purchase and you wanna claim the freebie from that one, that is fine. One per person. Um, yeah, I just wanna make sure. I don't wanna just charge someone for something that's that, that they don't want. You know, if I want them to get the item that they want. So, 
Any Hoozle. This is number 86. Sterling silver. Heart in the middle bracelet. And um, we're going to do this one for $37. $37. This is almost 17 inches. 17 grams of silver. So it's a heavy one. All right. Next up. This is Cuban Link, Flat Curb Link, Sterling Silver, of course, all of these are sterling. And it is right in between seven and seven and a quarter on the bracelet mandrel. This is an Italian sterling chain by IBB International Bullion Brokers, 925 Italy. And the other side says, IPB. Lobster claw clasp. Great condition. And this will be number 87. Number 87. And this has some nice weight to it as well. Um, we will do this one for uh we will do this one for $37. Yeah, $37. And then number 88, let's do this one. This is kind of a larger Figaro link. And this one is just shy of seven and three quarters. It's right on the line, way past seven and a half, but right on the line of seven and three quarters. And this one is 925 Italy. It says made in Italy on one side and 925 on the other. And this one has some really good weight to it. Let's see. Super nice. And we are going to do number 88. Um, we will do this one for $41. Number 88 is $41. Just grab the next one. This one is exactly seven and a half inches. Nice weight to it. It is marked 925 on one side. The other side says MD28V. I don't know what that, what that means, but that's what it says. Let's look. 925, and the other side is upside down. Interesting, huh? So this one is number 89. Zia, I was born. Very nice one. Um, we will do this one. Uh, we'll do this one for 41 as well. Number 89 is 41. All right. This one is seven exactly, and this has a spring ring clasp, and it is marked with the word sterling written out on the clasp. Oh, I was looking. I didn't know if, I, didn't, I guess I didn't look on that part to see if it was marked on the jump ring. We will look at that too. It is marked sterling on the jump ring. I'm sorry, on the spring ring, and the jump ring says, what does it say? Hmm. Let me read. It says, this is an older style, so maybe ACO. Something, this is an older one, probably. Well, 60s or before, I would say. This is number 90. This one is seven inches exactly. And uh, we will do this one for 41 as well. And last but certainly not least, this is a double curb link. This one, very nice weight to it. This one is marked made in Italy on one side and 925 on the other. 925 and 
made in Italy. In Italy. Double link. This is super nice, classic, heavyweight, um, and this will be number 91. And actually, we'll do this one for 41 as well. Why not? We will do this one for 41 as well. And again, this one is six and three quarters, size six and three quarters. And now, back to the charms. Um, this I bought individually almost two years ago, I would say. And let me show you. I was trying to see like under this stronger loop to determine if it was enameling. No, this is Sleeping Beauty turquoise. Enameling or Sleeping Beauty turquoise underneath or in the inlay. You know what I mean, Joe. Just looking underneath the loop. Trying to get it. There you go. See? Very nice. And again, if you need um, sterling jump rings on any charm purchased, it is free. Just let me know you need them in your email. Say, I need, you know, I need a sterling charm on each one. Or I'm sorry, I need a sterling jump ring on each charm I bought. And I will do that for you. The last one was 91, wasn't it? I think, I think we've skipped, I'm gonna skip a number because I think I, I had a confusion. So this will be number 92, the sterling native style Roadrunner number 92. And we will do this bad boy for $18. Number 92 is $18. And let's do, oh, look at this, you guys. I am obsessed with this. It is a little one, just little, but it is so cool. This is a malachite. And the whole back is sterling and it's got a sterling affixed ring on it as you can see just a little guy but it, it's very different I, I just really like it I think it's I think it's unique so this is number 93 for the sterling malachite star eight bucks number 93 is eight dollars um, number 94 let's do this one, let me look at this one under the loop too. No, it's cold, it's not enameling. Yep. Oh, it's open in the back with the stone. Obviously it's stone. Duh. Let's see. This is the back. That's the back. This is the front. nice weight to it. It is marked down here. Sterling Unlimited Thailand. This is number 94. And um, we will do this for $7. Number 94 is $7. This is number 95. This is a turquoise chip inlay sterling charm. Don't see markings on this one. Um, this will be number 95. This one's a little bit bigger than the others, but. And this, the affixed ring opens up so you can put it right on your bracelet or I can give you a jump ring, no problem. Looks like there's almost like a little drill hole at the top maybe. Doesn't feel like there's a hole there, but I'm not sure. Um, when you look at anything with a 40 times magnification, you'll find something wrong. Um, this is number 95 and we will do this for 
um, we will do this for five bucks. Yeah, number 95, $5. Number 96, this is our last, oh, we, I have um, an amethyst one right here, and that's amethyst, but this is our last, I guess, southwest or turquoise. This is a really nice one, and good size. I don't see any markings on it. Actually, that might have said sterling at one point on the side, but I am not for sure. So, number 96, um, we will do this one. It's a good size and weight. We will do this one for $14, one four. Number 96, vintage sterling turquoise chip inlay, good size. $14, number 96. Um, 97. This is a little sterling amethyst, and it almost looks like chevron amethyst, but a smaller piece. Maybe it's just regular amethyst. Little amethyst chip, number 97. Sterling silver, $5. Number 97 is five dollars and number 98 this is marked stir s-t-e-r usa and this one is there we go kind of a doily scallop setting sterling usa this is number 98 and this little guy we will do for fourteen dollars as well. One four. Number ninety eight is fourteen dollars. Um, and then I have these little bezel set Swarovski glass. These are glass crystals. And this one, little green one, will be number ninety nine. And let me show you. Beautifully cut um, with the affixed loop. Give me a jump ring, let me know. Number 99, $5. Number 99 is $5. And 100. This one is Poiple. I really like this one. It's a big one. Okay. This one is larger it's the table setting on both sides gorge this is number 100 and um, we will do this for eight dollars number 100 eight dollars and let's see um for 101 let's do this this is our sterling silver bell um, it is marked 925 on the top. And there is a brand stamp. I will read that out to you. But super, super pretty. This brand stamp looks like a, let me see if the light helps or not. Oh, J E Z. This is um, not Jezebel. Um, Jelaine. Jelaine. J E Z. Lovely brand. Sterling silver. Little bell. And I'm not. I'm thinking I got this one in the UK, but I, I can't remember for sure. So I don't want to say for sure. Um, uh, this one is number 101. And we will do this one for um, $18. Number 101 is $18. And 
we're going to do a little secret word giveaway for our, this is costume. This was sold to me as Sterling. It is not. It is costume. But very pretty, good size, still a cool bell. Um, and the secret word for this one will be gammy because today is gammy's birthday. I was gonna go down to visit her, got everything ready just for the day. But uh, Patrick, for the first time in the 12 years we've been together, he has a terrible stomach flu, like got up Ralphie. So, and Gammy, we cannot risk getting her sick. She's 88 this year, I think, 87. She'll send me a picture. She always takes a birthday picture for me and sends it. So free, this is free with any purchase um, from this video. Just tell me the secret word, Gammy, in your email and I will add it to your purchase as an extra gift for free. Um, next up, this is super, 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 super heavy. So know that if you buy this, this is very heavy. This is a branded one. It, the writing on that almost looks like a lot of the Israeli writing, but this to me, yeah, it's like crabs or lobsters. Let me show you. I know it looks like it opens up, but it does not, and I'm not going to force it. Um, little enameled blue crabs. This is very, 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 very heavy. It is very heavy. Let me say that again. It is very heavy. Maybe F925? I'm not sure. So if that bothers you, if, just, just know that. Um, this one, number 102, is going to be, um, let's see, hold on. Yeah, this weighs more than the average Figaro chain I was selling. Not exaggerating. The heavier one, this weighs more than that. This is number 102, and we will do this one for uh, $23. Number 102, $23. Um, number 103, so let's do the pirate ship since we just did the um, blue crabs. This is a good size charm, as you can see. Very detailed. And it has a cartouche on the back with the word Sterling written out. Definitely vintage at least, probably older than that. Older than the minimum for vintage. Um, this is number 103. And we will do this one for uh, 20 bucks. Number 103, $20. Um, and let's do, oh, let's do our travel ones now. That's a good segue. I've got two that are exact, whoops, two that are exactly the same. I got them at different times. One has a little more wear than the other. Um, and then I have this. I don't know what it means. It says 26.2. Maybe that's kilometers, like if you're doing a race or something, or maybe it's for climbing. I don't know. 26.2. So, um, if you want this one, this will not be considered part of, you know, the sale, but I will do, because this is, you know, a thick charm, I will do this one for $2. Just say I want the 26.2 charm for two dollars two dollars um and then the north south east and west charms these are sterling this one has a 925 mark on the back the one that has more wear this one 
does not. So this is the older one. This will be number 104. And there's a 925 on the back. So if you want 104, the older one, 104, the older one, this one, hold on. I guess I didn't hit the pause. <laughs> well, so I'm not going to have enough numbers to go any longer. So we are going to end on the letters. So this will be number 108. This is a rectangle with the letter N as in Nancy on the back and it is hand signed. So you have the N stamp and maybe Darius or Julius is the brand I'm not sure um, this is number 108 and we will do this one for seven dollars number 108 is seven dollars um, let's see do I have any other ends I thought I might have a second yes I have another N, I have an M, I have a C, S, I have a Kathy, I have an H, and I have, oh, that's Kathy. And I have a Kayla. All right, this is our other letter N, as in Nancy. This one is a circle. N, as in Nancy. And I don't see a marking on the back. Um, and we will do this one for $5. Number 109 is $5. Number 110, this is a very old one. It's marked with the word Sterling written out and a cursive letter H. Um, I almost kept this for myself. It is super pretty and it is old. It has, let me show you. Sterling written out on the back. This is number 110, and um, we will do this for $18. 18. And number 111, um, let's do Kayla. This says Kayla. Little Sterling heart with the word Kayla. And this is number 111. And um, let's see, we will also do this one separate from the deal. How about that? Well, so this one will just be $2 separate from the deal. It's $2 for anyone, whether you have discounts or not. $2 for the word Kayla, $2. And while we're doing that, I promised I have one more giveaway. This is a pewter number seven, a pewter number seven, jeez, oh, a pewter size seven sugar skull ring. It's just cute, it's just a fun ring. Um, and this, um, we will. The keyword is white, white. That's Gammy's last name and um, my mom's maiden name. So we'll use that white, like, like the color. All right, so for 111, we will do Kathy. This says Kathy, 10858 with the word Sterling written out. Um, and you can very easily and very cheaply have the existing initials buffed out 
and replaced if you want, or just take the letters off and leave it plain. This is a little girl's silhouette. It says the word Sterling written out on the back and the date. So this is a very old one, obviously. It's at least from 1958. Um, this is number 111. And um, we will do number 111 for um, $14. Number 111, $14. Um, number 112. This is a little letter M as in Mary M. Sterling, I will add a jump ring if you need it. A sterling jump ring if you need it, of course. Letter M as in Mary um, or Michelle like my mother. So we will do this one for $5. Number 112, $5. Uh, number 113, C. Gammy's name starts with a C. This is a thick one. She's thick. And this looks like someone did, yeah, hand stamping with that. It's a handmade hand stamped piece. Nice heavy one with the matching existing jump ring. You can tell she is thick. So um, this is number 113. Number 113, letter C as in Charlene. And um, we will do this for $8, why not? Number 113 is $8. Number 114, we have the cursive letter S, as in Sharon, with the word STER, S-T-E-R. And it looks like there's a brand stamp on this as well. And does it have a stamp up there? Yep. This has the original tag and it says stir. Sterling and something E. Oh, this is Bo Sterling. B-E-A-U. Bo Sterling. These are old, the old style charm bracelets. Their little tab would always be stamped. So this is the original tab that came with this. Uh, Bo Sterling, Sterling Silver, number 114S. Um, we'll do this for 10 bucks. Number 114S, Bo Sterling for 10 bucks. And actually we have one left because I did, uh, I made that one three dollars uh, let's do this is the last thing I have with turquoise in it and this obviously needs a jump ring this will be number 115 it just has the uh, loop at the top um sterling like Bali style beads and turquoise beads and this one is number 115, and uh, we will do this for $7. Number 115 is $7, and that, my friends, is all the letters that I have for today. So, once again, if you want to purchase anything, um, I will print out some more letters, and we will keep going. And keep the, because we've still got so many <laughs> charms to do. Um, we've done now like 42 bracelets, so we've done like 55 charms, um, and there's more to go. I have insane, in insane inventory that I got in this week for our live on Tuesday. You guys are going to flip your lid. I am so excited. Um, I have been a busy little bee, uh, but yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, 
and check out parts one, two, and three of our charm and sterling charm bracelet and charm series. And yeah, I will see you next time, guys.